we're back and we're with one of our favorites, our fashion guru, Chris Zinn, with us now via Skype from Louisville, Kentucky. Hey, girl. Hey. Hi, Hi there. How you doing? It's good to see you. Yeah, you too. I miss you guys. Miss you too, but I'm glad you could be with us today. Yeah. What, what are we talking about? Well, last time, you know, we talked about uh, taking advantage of boutiques and their free shipping and right. things like that. That's great. And I suggest that anything new, one piece is great and makes me feel better. But don't underestimate your own closet. Shop your closet. Um, you I always say, go on Pinterest, look at different things. We started, my husband and I have started watching um, Making the Cut with Heidi Klum and just watching them uh, the contestants making stuff, making clothes, and things that they wear. I get so many ideas. And you know, the big thing now is distressing and distressed clothes. And I do love it. Love, love, love. So I went to my closet. I found a Gap sweatshirt that's probably 15 years old. And I love it, but I haven't worn it in probably five years. So I thought, I can't sew, um, but I can cut. So I got some scissors. Here's my right here now it was a hooded sweatshirt here's the hood i was going to cut it around here and make it kind of that flash dance kind, yes, of, off the shoulder yes. kind of look yeah but i decided i wanted to keep because inside the hood it's lined with this really pretty blue so i cut just above where the grommets are where the strings come through and just above that then i took the strings from the hood brought it back through and tied it there at the beginning, at the, the very front. So well, aren't you clever? That, isn't it that cute? was good. Yes, it's cute. Good job. I, I can't wait to wear this with the people I don't know in my neighborhood. <laughs> yeah. They're going to want it. They're going to want they it. Are, and I'm going to charge them for it. Um, <laughs> and I put then, it was already a little distressed because that's how the gap ran. And But I did make some more cuts in it. Don't go crazy on it because then it will fall apart whenever you try to wash it. Now, Angie, since I don't sew, but this is COVID-19 fashion, I looked at that hood and I said, hey, what could I do with that hood? Well, with a few cuts, bam, OMG. You made yourself a mask. Oh, I love it. You are a clever girl. I love it. And you should wear that mask with that sweatshirt. Well, it'll be too matchy-matchy, but yeah, <laughs> I'd probably do that. Well, that was but, very clever. Well, yeah, I was bored because I'm not doing anything. <laughs> uh, but yeah, stuff like that. There are other things. Um, I have shirts, sweater, cardigans. This one, for instance. Ah, okay. okay, it's just a button-down. Okay, it's great. Love it over stuff. But you turn it around to where the buttons are in the back. Put a long necklace down that. And there's the back. How cute is that? You got two shirts. That so, is that's cute. Now I mean, would you would you do that? I mean would you do that wear that yes. look or have you already done it? I would never I've not done it, but I mean I did it in my bedroom. I modeled for my cat. <laughs> <laughs> um, yes, I would never suggest anything to you all that I haven't done or will do myself. I promise. Well, that that's really good. So, I mean, just shop your closet. Then I'm having to do that too, Chris, thanks to you. I mean, going back and going, when did I wear that before? So we just need to repurpose what we have and then shop local. That's your message today. You need to distress things, you know, scissors. Start with something you don't wear or don't like because if you screw up, who cares? And make it new. Yeah. Or use your kids' stuff, because who cares? Thank you, darling. It's good to see you. Stay safe. You too. Take care. Bye. We'll be back with more local lifestyles after this message. Stay with us.